entering Dan. Welcome to the Corona House. Welcome to an open house in the Corona House. She's got it on a stand. See how she's got it? Like that. She's got it inserted in a stand. She's just got it made out of, looks like fiberboard or something. It's just kind of inexpensive thin boarding. You can get that pattern. Welcome to the house. I have my antique sled from Salem. <laughs> Hi. And this is our entryway. And to your right, as we come in, there's our bedroom, which is kind of different. on there. Here's one of my dolls that I made. <laughs> Bob's going to find this real interesting, I'm sure. That's one of my dolls. That's not my painted doll, though. And here's some of Barb's things that she does. She does a lot of rocky horses. Barb does a lot of wooden rocky horses. Real cute. And my boxes. We kind of did all our pastel things in our bedroom. And there's our, that's our, of course, our dressing area. You can see our bathroom is back beyond there. And I'm using, this is not okay. I'm using that antique piece I had in Salem. I'm using that for display. And so we have all our pastel things in there. Uh, I did a lot of the Raggedy Ann's this year. I did them in just different colors. I did my own. I did my own, my own little Raggedy Ann's instead of the bought last year. And they've been kind of good sellers. And my painted doll, I did another painted doll. And I've got a bigger painted doll I did too. I painted dolls that I, I did. That's off that pattern we did back in the And oh I'll show you something you might like to do that Barb did. And these are really cute. It's kind of her own little idea. It's a, a wooden angel. It's just a wooden like one of those little pieces of wood she cut out. And then it's got one of those balls on top. She put moss on it. And then the paper ribbon for the wings. It's, and you can put peace or joy, you know. And those have been real good sellers for Barb. a lot of these. This is off the, oh, okay. Martha, hi. <laughs> Remember this angel we bought down in Nashville? I did these last year, but you probably, they're really easy to do. I took my doll apart. We got in Nashville and did mine. That's how I came up with the pattern. Whoops. Okay. And I don't think there's anything too different here. Just some my boxes. And, oh, and um, thank you get an overview of the room. The stocking I told you about is hanging on the end of my bed. Probably looks plain in the video, but it's it, they are real pretty they're, and they're real easy to do. And they're just done with natural colors. Kind of, kind of contemporary, kind of Victorian too. Hey Martha!
the Rocky Horses. This is one Barb. She might like that. But she's done quite. She sold quite a few of those. Real cute. Okay. Well, this goes to our basement. The tomb. The tomb where Nate lives. Oh, okay. You can come on into the living room if you like, Martha and Bob and Andrew and Ben. <laughs> In some new kids you might have. Well, this is my color. Okay. And here's our living room. You walk in from the entryway and go straight into our living room. And I, want, I told you about these eggs. I thought they were really cute. It's, this is the Santa Claus. Can you zoom in on this, too? Because I told her about it. See? And it, she's written on the back, Seasons Greetings from a Jolly Good Egg. And I thought it was really cute. It's a cute idea. It's inexpensive. And, you know. Okay? This, this is one of my pieces that I had in sale and that we always displayed on. Oh, my thimble. I told you about my thimbles. So you can see this. <laughs> That's my little thimble that looks like it's got Santa Claus painted on the face. I thought you might be interested because you could do those up real fast. Okay. Okay, so this was our living room. Here again. <laughs> it, Joe's just getting ready to leave and we wanted to get him on tape. And, so and any was, new animals you have. <laughs> and there, and of course, Andrea. Andrea. Come on. Bye. See ya. Merry yeah. Christmas. I'm going yeah. too. She got fun. Yeah. I'm going to get our window, so to show you in our living room, that's our half circle window. We paid so much extra to get that we're glad we got it. it. Adds to the room. And here's our dining room, which goes from our living room. Then on in here to our dining room. Makes for a great display, you know. And it has a little tree that I I got at a garage sale that was <laughs> really didn't stay up very good, but I I'm sure I've got it, got it anchored, I guess. Hi, honey. Hi. 
He's gone. I know I look really bad right now. This is not how I ever how I look, but today it is. I'm 18 today too. Oh, that's right. Today's Andrew's birthday. Don't film and get another printer. We, we took her to. Eighteenth birthday, she's eighteen today, and we took her to TGI Fridays for lunch. Spent a bundle on her lunch, huh. didn't we? You but it was what we wanted to. Yeah, we. we it was fun. Went. I was eating donuts. He's eating chips. We're real health nuts here. Yeah. Yeah. We changed our whole style of eating. We <laughs> only shop at General Nutrition Center. Right. <laughs> That's what those malls are for. Yeah. yeah. Oh, here's our. This is Bonnie. Bonnie out, honey. Well, honey, that's family, you know. Here's our Chris. Our here's our Santa Claus collection. These Barb does all these. She does just different types. This one's cute. She did one bigger than this, and it was real cute. She she sold it already. Got this little character is real cute. That one, this, and that one again. She's got, and then she, you'll see, she's got another. She's got another. Excuse me. Here's another one of her. Her Santa Claus is it's real cute. She has, She likes, of course, doing Santa Claus. I thought maybe you might get an idea. Maybe you know, for next year, different kinds of Santa Claus. Yes, that's about all in this room. You probably see, everything you see is pretty familiar. I've got everything I had the same thing in Salem. I'm trying to sell our, our piano. Get some bucks out of it. Come on out. We'll go out on the deck. <laughs> it's just like this old house. You walk out our back. You walk out our back door from our living room, and we have. Even though we our homes are really close together, we do have this back area, which is a wooded area. It's really, uh, it's nice. It's nice to have this because it gives you the privacy and you feel like you're out, you know. Those, see the kind of homes, how far they are, so it's not too bad. But you can see how close, show her how, show them how close we are to the next house. Very close to the house. Nice homes, but real close. And there's our neighbor's home inside of our house. We haven't been able to spend very much time out here this summer. Jim is so busy. I wanted to show you this. This is a um, this is similar to the other one, but it's more of a tree ornament. It's a smaller type. The type, and she just cut it. It's a this is all one piece of wood. It's not that isn't like a little ball. That's just all one piece of wood. And she did it similar to the other one I showed you earlier. And these were real good. These were good for tree ornaments that I did this year. And those were real popular at the bazaar last week. I sold all that I had. Okay. An overall view of our living room. And you can't see it, but up there is the there's a balcony area up. It's kind of hard to get from in the living room you can kind of look up and see there's a like a landing up in the up there in the loft area and that leads into uh, Vaughn's room. Okay? We'll go on in now into the where we spend most of our time. <laughs> well, at least in the refrigerator, from the refrigerator on up to the TV area. So, and so here we are, in the kitchen. We have a, I don't know how tall the walls are, but this has got, we've got a, oh, this, I'm not sure what gym area. And then we have, you know, I've got my wall. Here's my quilt. I told you about my quilt rack that I had. I display my quilts on. You can see what it's made like, and it's really neat to display. I got, I got several people asking me about that, that rack and how it's made. But you can get a general idea. And then you can see in our kitchen also there's a loft area. You can see the, the other side of the loft from here. And that's where we got the TV present. You know, it's, I don't know, it's just, it's really comfortable, and, you know. Of course, you can yell up there, and everybody can hear you in the whole house. It makes it nice. <laughs> Turn your music on up there, and it just flows over the whole house. <laughs> anyway. You know, I was really thrilled about having that area, excuse me, <laughs> over the cabinets because of 
putting all my collectibles up there. So to our right is a utility room, and to our left is Paul oh, Honey. I kept some of my things I was working on yesterday, Chuck. And um, we've got a small bathroom downstairs, which is kind of nice to have. Oh, you should, yeah. Show them our, oh, well, I guess you can't see our wood floors. Okay. We'll go on upstairs. I'll show you Vaughn's room and Andrew's room. Don't get a picture of it. Hi. What up? <laughs> see how you like it up here? We're going up. We're going to Vaughn's room. Come on, Vaughn. Go in your room. Show them. Oh. Jim's going to show you an overview <laughs> from the top down. That's, this wow. is the living room from up here. Look at that view. Okay, Vaughn must. It was Vaughn's room. I don't want to show him. You show him. No, it's your room, Vaughn. Go on. Mm -hmm. Your show. Tell me about your room, Vaughn. Well, it's a bed, it's a desk, it's a file cabinet, it's my dresser, it's my closet. Those are my posters. Stay in here and tell more. I can track him. Yep. Yeah. Say me. That guy right there. <laughs> okay. That was a fun little thing. Oh, there's my phone over there. It's a holder, stereo, show these hats. All right, we're going to Andrew's. Andrea, come and show Mark and Bob and Ben and Andrew your room. Oh. Oh, we had to do this. <laughs> oh, of course. Okay, just a minute. I'm not sure. This is our, our loft area. We watch TV up here. 